WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and currently we have a sea of red out there. All the uh, all the sectors within inside the S&P 500, all the U.S. indices that we track are trading to the downside. Dow's up 176 points, a half a percent. One percent, one percent for the S&P or 44. A little over one percent for the Nasdaq 100, 168 points there. One and a quarter percent for the Russell, 22 point move. Eight tenths for the semis, that's 28 points. The trend is down 61. Four tenths there. Gold is off 27 bucks, over 1% move. Silver down 23 pennies, that's 1%. Light sweet crude is up 46 cents, trading out at 90.11. That's a half percent move to the upside. You've got natural gas down about 2%, off a nickel, and the 30 year treasury down nearly 2%, down two full points and five ticks, trading out at 116.13. So, what's all that mean, Jelly Bean? Let's go take a look at that nine panel market update chart. We begin the ES Mini up the left hand side. What do we have going on? Well, we've got one thing that's going on, and there's a test of a very important swing point that is August 18th's low. 43.9775. If we get a close below that, we'll be taking a look at an A to B equals C D to the downside. If we get that, then we're looking at a first price projection, initial price projection of 43.10. If we take a look at the spot volatility, it is above its 50-day exponential moving. <laughs> Exponents moving average closed above it yesterday, remains above it today. Sellers are the ones that are in control of the market. In the case of the NQ, it's trading back into a swing point. This is a swing point from August the 18th. Uh, that top of that swing point is 14,982. Watch for a test and rejection of that. But if price closes inside there, 14,792.75 would be the target. And if price closes below 14,792, then you'd have an A to B equals CD to the downside with an initial price projection of 14,384. If we take a look at what's going on inside the U.S. dollar index, well, it closed above the top of its daily profile yesterday. It's trading above it today. It's simply all out bullish. If we take a look at Goldilocks, it's trading in between trend lines, descending trend lines, rising trend lines, as well as with inside its uh, pro, uh, profile levels, 1928.30 for support, 1954.64 resistance. Silver is the trading with inside its profile that has supported 23.32, resistance 20, 23.74. <clears throat> Light sweet crude also consolidating with inside its profile level, support at 8801, resistance 9054. Natural gas pulling back, maybe it's gonna go target its bullish structured area between 253 and 264. And you've got a small A to B equals CD to the downside inside the 30 year treasury. That's gonna need a bullish reversal candle to suggest that it's bottom. Otherwise, price is likely to go target 115.69. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show. But if you're off to start your Thursday, please have a terrific one. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.